Hi to Chaco. There's the arc mates. We have a footman for Blade here. Blade going for footman. And I can push the arc mates. Summons the water elemental. This ogre warrior is going down, guys. Roar! Stream lagging? I I think it's you, right? Else other people would say the same shit. You wouldn't be the only one that's saying the stream is lagging. At the bottom right, you can lower the quality, by the way. Right? If, uh. You know? If the stream is lagging for you. Blade Master going for the first tall high priest. Just killing it. Just. He's dead. Her Planet Potion. Does he pick it up? He picks it up. Oh, this footman. The Blade Master going for the footman. The Archmage here with three footmen and a water elemental just. Scaring away the Blade Master. Blade Master uses a uh, replenishment potion. Very nice game so far. So is he going Wyvern again? I doubt. Oh, nothing special. Okay. I doubt it, right? <laughs> against Zeko, I was playing Wyvern because Zeko is so bad against Wyvern. But Blade, different story. Just trying to cut up the Archmage. Archmage. Okay. Water elemental and footman. It's going for Blade Master, but he's gonna cut apart. It's going for the footman. The footman. Blade Master going for the Archmage now, but the Archmage on his horse, he's running so fast through the water. And I mean, Blade Master. I mean, the Archmage has boosted speed, he's so fast. Blade Master doesn't stand a chance to catch him. Four footman, one water elemental. A player's forces are under attack. So what are we getting here? There's no grunt yet. I mean, he has two grunts, but he's not building the third grunt is what I'm trying to say. Maybe he wants to build a third grunt. This Archmage is very low on level, so the Blade Master did a good job. Pretty good jo job at keeping the Archmage at level one. First of Trapper going down. Oh yeah, the Blade Master was too late there. Archmage needs one more kill, then he gets level two. There goes the Footman. Maybe at some point he can start killing the Blade Master. Blade Master pretty low on hit points. He has one wind block, but no speed scroll, no no items whatsoever. And the Archmage, boots of speed, claws of attack. If he can damage this Blade Master enough, there goes a water metal. He did. Did he get XP? I'm not sure if he did. I forgot how much XP it was at. 60, 66? Was he at 66 XP? I doubt it, right? It's such a weird number. So I think the exp uh, water, water elemental just expired. There is the double beast theory, so I think he's going for double uh, wyvern again, just like he did against Zeko. Two wyvern and then probably back into raiders. Zulabar. Zulabar and with Daisho. Level 1 Daisho. Level 1 Zulabar. Let's be on the scout. Look at the scout, guys. There's some priests here. We have a Mount King for Blade. Pretty standard so far. Is he going for this creep camp? Yeah, very safe. Very strong creep camp. Very beautiful item if you... Uh, depending what item you get, but most of the items here are very good. On 1 per 29, Orc replaced with Wyvern because he doesn't like to play standard for his buff clap. Oh, good point there with Demon. Uh, this good is <laughs> so long hit points. What, the, does he, what does he get there? Potion of greater mana. And what did we get here for uh, Blade? Blade, he got a Boots of Quattle Last. Not that amazing with these heroes. This is like the worst item. The worst item he could have gotten. He's priest healing the peasants up a little bit. Uh, do we have the wyvern, by the way? There's a wyvern. He has one over there. One over there. He's building a third wyvern. And a fourth wyvern, even. Okay. 
This time he doesn't play against the Beastmasters. Zeko played the Beastmasters. That's why he only built two Wyvern and then he went back to other units. Uh, this peasant is dead. He went back to uh, Raiders and Sp Spirit Walkers. Sources slows one Wyvern. Let's see. He does have a Berserker. The, the Archmage is still level 2. I think maybe he should have prioritized this level 3 Archmage. <laughs> Remember, Zeko did the same thing when he had a Mount King and an Archmage. But he didn't. I, I think he didn't know yet that it was against Wyvern. I think he scouted it. But one Wyvern is dead, guys. Not very good for Orc Worker. What item did Orc Worker get? Book of the Dead. Uh, it is a nice book of the Dead. There's no dispel yet, and I don't think we'll get dispel anytime soon. So the Book of the Dead is a pretty good item. A pretty good one. Right? Like. Use oh, and another Wyvern dying. Oh no! Orc Worker! Hello! Playing too much poker here. <laughs> Maybe he's playing a game of poker during this game. Uh, these two wyvern. Killing peasants. There's a level 2 water metal. You know, gonna defend against the evil wyvern. This wyvern is slowed. Takes quite a bit of damage. Mountain King is now level 3. He has gloves of haste for extra... Uh, what does it say for extra bashes? But he probably has clap, of course. It's 1.29. It used to be bash on your Mount King. Now you get clap. But against Wyvern? Do you get bash, maybe? I don't know. Let's pay close attention to this Mount King. Let's see if we see him clap, or I mean, we don't see him clap until the fight. But let's see if we see him bash. Stormbolt. I don't see any bashes. So I think we can assume he has clap. A player's forces are under attack. There's more Wyvern. He does have a spirit lush up. Building some spirit walkers. Did he sell the Book of the Dead by the way, or does he still have it? He did sell it. Uh, no wait, it was an orc who got it. Uh, let's check it. Okay, he still has it. He's probably gonna use it to uh, creep, I wanna say, but you don't want the Book of the Dead to get shockwaved. Okay, he's not using it to creep, by the way. He's just creeping. Archmage here killing some Murlocs. Mountain King with two gloves of haste, guys. He attacks so fast. Blade Master 129 critical strike. This is a wind walk. Hold oh, no, up, Blade Master! Okay. 23 hit points. All you need, guys. All you need. <laughs> There's a level 3 Shadow Hunter now. Oh no, there's a Wyvern to creeps. It's almost just as bad. Hood of Cunning, not a great item. Not a great item. I, this item will go to Blade. And uh, Blade has a Rune Bracers. Not that good. He gets Rune, rune Bracers over here. Uh, it's completely useless against Orc. There's not a single damage it reduces. There's no spells here. No spells. Archmage almost level 4. Three Wyvern, some Peons, Blade Master still healing. He has the Book of the Dead though. Do we have Dispel? No Dispel, as expected. When you're playing against Wyvern, you just you just don't get Dispel, really. Uh, but maybe if he scouted the Book of the Dead at some point, he would get Dispel. But I don't think he scouted the Blade Master since, since he got the Book of the Dead. We have no Dragonhawks as well. Completely missed that because I was so focused on uh, Worker losing his Wyvern all over the place, all over the map. Mount King almost level 4. Uh, there's no Raiders, there's no Bat Riders, so there's only Hex to cancel these Shackles. And oh, there's one Hex. We have uh, one more uh, Shackle, right? Why does this other Dragon Hawk no Shackle? Nice! Uh, clap here, hits a lot of units, a lot of peons, a lot of everything. There's a Book of the Dead though, uh, and there's a Clap. The Mount King might die even though it has an Info Potion. Where is there's no Dispel, of course. So the Mount Oh, there's an Info Potion! The Mount King didn't die fast enough. I don't understand why. It seems like there was enough damage. Uh, maybe something was not targeting the Mountain King, the Archmage here. Level 4 Archmage. He has a TP. He's invisible now because... Uh, oh, there's another clap. All the skeletons gone, guys. And there's the G. There is the G. Blade wins the first game in the finals. The scout, of course, delays your attack by so much. So it's not really a fast stack. It's not really a... Uh... Oh, no. There's this burrow. Okay. So yeah, Blade Master and Grunt, the Archmage. The Archmage, guys.
Arguments going for the giant sea turtle. Blade Master on his way. We have a grunt here. The grunt walks past the food man. The Blade Master sells some items, buys a circlet, and you know, he knows. A player's what does he know? Under attack. Didn't scout cross position, of course. But now he probably has a pretty good idea that his opponent is cross position. There's a footman in his base. The grunt's on his way to scout the archmage that's creeping here. It's a Lannister. He has a Claws of Attack and a Slippers of Agility already. And he's level 2 now. The Blade Master gets a Claws of Attack. He has no shop. So he's definitely. He cannot creep. He's already low on hit points. 300 hit points. So, uh. Oh, no, he's creeping. Okay, well, it's, I guess, you know, he will go home after creeping this turtle, for sure. we will have to, and buy uh, health salves, healing salves. But this gives so much time here for uh, for Blade to creep. Although, what does Blade creep? If he doesn't use Militia, there's nothing really to creep. And Blade doesn't creep. He's going for... Uh, what is he going to do here? Blade. Blade, guys. He sees the low hit point blade master with the foot band, so now he realizes he can creep something. Easy peasy. But you know, does he call militia? He could even creep this red creep camp over there, even knowing the grunt is there. Even with the grunt there, I feel like he could have crapped something greedy. Maybe he didn't see the blade master with his foot band. There's no illusions on this map. I feel like Blade just gave a lot of time to this uh blade master to just heal up. Or at least walk all the way back to his base, buy all the items. Well, one the healing self is only bought, by the way. No scroll, scroll of the speed, no clarity. Of course, you don't buy ever. Oh, he did buy clarity. <laughs> he did buy clarity and use it. Uh, anyway, the footman. Yeah, I feel like you know. I feel like this was a mistake by Blade. Just you know, giving so much time to the Blade Master to come and find him. Not scraping anything. He almost surrounds the, foot, uh, the grunt. Now he surrounds the blade match, but he did have, uh, you know, mana for one wind block. Oh, nice surround on the grunt. Uh, the blade master, the grunt, trying to save the grunt. The grunt is probably not going to be saved, but he will get maybe a footman here. You know, maybe not. I guess the footman survives. I mean, it's not like the, bl the blade master has to be careful himself. He's out of mana. Uh, no scroll, <laughs> scroll of speed, ball clarity. Are we watching Lado and I just chuckle class? <laughs> yeah. Uh, I don't know. It's definitely, uh, definitely some Lado plays in this game. The Lannister is level two and a half. Daisho level one and a half. Lannister, of course, wants level three. He is going for the Mountain King. He does go for Double Arcane Sanctum. Archmage picks up another close of attack. Hello, plus 15 damage on the Archmage. Soon he will just kill the Blade Master. Uh, he didn't get the Water Elemental that just expired. Archmage is with a few attacks on the Blade Master. Again, he does have the boost of speed. He does so much damage and he moves so fast. In other words, he's just like the Blade Master. <laughs> Look at this Blade Master just dying to the Archmage. There's some more attacks on this Blade Master. This Blade Master doesn't have any healing cells left. Again, he will have to go all the way across the map. Oh no, wait, never mind. There's a Shadow Hunter. He has healing cells. The Archmage is trying to get the Blade Master, but not anymore. With the Blade the Shadow Hunter here. He's dead, guys. Oh, is he dead? He's dead. It was a bit a bit too greedy by uh Blade. Trying to get the Blade Master. Trying to master the Blade Master. So, Archmage will be back in 172 seconds. A there's a priest, and there's no shop here. He's just relying on the priest to heal his units. Nice game. Blade Master and Shadow Hunter. Zulkis, guys. Zulkis. Spirit Walkers and Wyvern. Again, he's building Wyvern out of just one bestiary. Wyvern gets webbed and snared. There goes the ogre and gets a nice bandit of energy. Gives it to the Shadow Hunter, I think. Okay, Shadow Hunter picks it up. He likes it. He enjoys it. He's like, wow, nice. There goes the Mountain King. 
Stormbolt on. Nothing. He's a crap. Here comes the militia. The Blade Master is. Hello. Oh, he's using Stormbolt now. Finally, at 142 ex uh, hit points, he's dead. Okay. Well. Um, okay. Well, there goes the food man. We have a bunch of priests here in the back, and the sorcerers. Is the Archmage back, or is he uh, just fighting without heroes? Oh, there's the Archmage. He's back. Okay, nice. Oh, top of XP. Who picks it up? Shadow Hunter picks it up. He's almost level three now. If he gets level three, he just wins the game. That's how you win games, guys. You get level three Shadow Hunter. Kills a footman. And what else is he killing? The Shadow Hunter doesn't have a lot of mana though, even though he had a pendant of energy. But uh, Blade Master hits, hits level three. Shadow Hunter needs one more kill. Two more XPs, guys. He used a level one healing wave, so that means even if he hits level three, he won't have mana for healing wave immediately. But in a few seconds, maybe. That level three, a uh, level two healing wave that will cast in like 10 seconds will just win him the game because uh, look, he's killing everything, he's not losing anything. Nice retreat here by Blade. Oh, there's Mountain King again. Hello, I'm back. 36 seconds. Oh, Blade Master needs that level two healing wave. He's not there yet. Oh, actually, um, maybe a Hex can save him. It's not even needed, is it needed? It's not even needed. Okay. Well, 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 guys. What a game. What a game here. There's a spirit walker. What a game. Archmage, still level 2. Mount King, level 1. Zero XP. A player's forces are Blade under Master, attack. level 3. Shadow Hunter, level 3. In other words, my <laughs> Blade is pretty dead. 36 spike and 49. Lumber mill is up. Oh, peasant dying to creeps. That's nice. At this point, it doesn't matter anyway. Who cares about your peasants? Who cares? Well, Blade cares. Or, well, Blade doesn't care, but... You know, maybe his Mountain King cares. Grim Thunderbrew cares. Buy some uh, dust here. Spion takes a bit of damage. And Spion is taking a lot of damage now. Actually, the Peon survives. Okay. A player's forces are under attack. A player's forces are under attack. The Blade Master with the Info Potion. The Shadow Hunter level 3 with uh, one of mana stealing. Probably should have given this pendant to the Blade Master for a second. Just to get a bit more mana on the Shadow Hunter. Gets uh, he gets clarity cancelled. I'm not sure how much he uh, healed, how much mana. But it's fine, guys. It's fine. 950 damage, critical strike, crystal ball. Wow. I feel like that. Uh, this is not the item he deserves. This is not the item he deserves, guys. Hard worker. He's been a hard worker in this game. He deserves a better item, better RNG. He also got a one of mana stealing, which is not a great item either. Picks up the rune. Okay, maybe he can get a good item over here. Meanwhile, the Archmage and the Mount King. There's a nice belt of giant strength. There's a Dragonhawk. Oh, wait. How come I didn't see this Griffin Aviary? It's building Dragonhawks. Hello, Ice Mouse. Hello. Mount King now. Level 3. Archmage, level 3.7. So yeah, I mean, Blade, he's slowly coming back in this game. He also doesn't have, have to pay taxes, guys. Here we have two level four heroes. But, you know, 4-4 four, four against 3-3 three, three is worse than 3-3 uh, three, three against 2-1. and one, <laughs> For sure. More units here are dying. This turtle died. Pendant of energy on the Mountain King. Pretty good. With a greater mana potion. Infinite mana. Infinite storm bolts. Blade Master buys a clarity, gives it to the Shadow Hunter, I assume. Yeah, he uses it. Nice. Shadow Hunter kind of long, long hit points, by the way. Maybe. Okay, there's a healing self on the Shadow Hunter. I was just saying, like, imagine if he stays at low hit points. And then he gets creepjacked by a Stormbolt and he just dies. But here's the Blade Master scouting around. Uh, does he see? He sees, guys. 
Do we, does he, do we dust here? There's a the dust. Uh, the Mountain King got the item. And the XP, I believe. The Archmage is level 4. The Blade Master is beautiful. Uh, it's a really nice item, by the way. And Django of Endurance. Best item he could have gotten there. Since he already has the, uh, you know, the Bronze Aura. He doesn't need it anymore. And so he gets the best item. And <laughs> is this a comeback? Is Blade just making this comeback? This is even possible. I thought this game was over. I feel like maybe Orc Worker played this wrong. I, uh, well, level 5 Shadow Hunter is going to be nice. Level 5 Shadow Hunter, guys, is going to be nice. But after he has such a big advantage, I don't, I don't understand. Why didn't he, he? He didn't even harass with a Wyvern. He didn't attack. He didn't go for an expansion or anything. He just grabbed the entire map. Which I don't think was the play here. When your opponent is under 50 and he was over 50. Or what? He went over 50 at least very very early. I mean, level 5 Shadow Hunter with a lot of mana now. Two pendants of energies, but he doesn't have full mana, so he's not that much mana. I mean, 470 mana is still a lot of mana, but not a lot of, of insane amounts of mana. He just has a lot of mana. This priest is uh, going down. And let's see. If, if this is my code, poorly by Orc Worker, he might still lose. There goes the Raider. And more raiders here about to die. Two raiders dead. The blade master killing and some sorceresses. Still shackles in the air. The wyvern are just I don't know. Is are there no hexes or are there no ensnares? <laughs> How come these dragonhawks are just free to uh, to shackle this wyvern? There's a stormbolt on this raider. It looks like uh, blade is just gonna win this game. To me, that's how it looks like right now. Now that the wyvern are dead and the dragonhawks are free to kill the spirit walkers. Uh, and the Mountain King is free to clap everything on the ground because he has infinite mana with that uh, mana potion that he will use in a moment. Militia are killing the Spirit Walkers as well. Uh, Kree Toy Balance. And uh, does he use the greater mana potion? Yes, he uses it. And the Stormbolt on the Blade Master and a clap. And Selena. I Sorry, I clicked OK too fast. I didn't see what he said there. But I, it was in a language I couldn't read anyway. Uh, Blade is now 2 0 up over Orc Worker. Take the ones without much of a taste, and then I dip them in chocolate, and then I have chocolate taste. It's really good. Really nice. It's more like a, a chocolate cookie. It's better, actually. Rice cakes uh, that you make yourself with chocolate to spread on top of them are actually better than most pre made chocolate cookies. Are under anyway, Blade Master going for this Renegade Wizard. Here we have an Arc Mage. He's creeping this creep camp over here, killing this renegade wizard. He's going down so fast. Ring of protection, not amazing. Blade Master, what is he getting here? Let's see if he's been, uh, if he's blessed today. Gloves of haste, not the item he wanted, but not the worst one either. Is uh, you know, not the circlet. His water metal working on this rogue. This rogue is taking a lot of damage, and he's dead. Slippers of agility <laughs> picked up by the archmage. That's pretty silly. These items are not good at all for endomath. Not so good. The footman scouting. Burrow going up. Blade Master is a beautiful hero, guys. A beautiful, absolutely beautiful hero. Joshua. Archmage finds a grunt. But the grunt. Oh, walking past the frog. Quack. And going home, maybe? I mean, no, not yet. He was just pretending he was afraid, but he's not afraid. He was just waiting for the Blade Master, his friend. He was waiting for his friend, and now he, he, now he wants a fight. The Archmage, of course, does not want to fight against the Blade Master and the Grunt. No, no thanks. The Grunt is already on a. No, never mind. He's building uh, another Grunt there. That's nice. Nice water elemental block on the Blade Master. Blade Master just cuts through the water. A player's forces are under attack. We have two footmen here. We have an Archmage here. Okay, we have three footmen here against a Grunt. The Grunt doesn't want to take that fight. So, I mean, the footmen want to creep, but they find a Blade Master. The Archmage, is he, what is he just doing here? Hello? Just standing? Is he gonna creep? He's not gonna creep. Blade Master, so sneaky, guys. So sneaky. Just invisible. He, you don't see him, but he's there, guys. Just think about that. Next time you go to the bathroom, look around the bathroom and just realize the Blade Master could be there. 
You don't see him, but he could be there, guys. Watching you. Waiting for the opportune moment to strike. Right now he's, uh, you know, he's trying to kill the Archmage though. So right now if you go to the bathroom, I can tell you there's no Blade Master there. Because he's over here hunting Andromath. Andromath on his horsey though. Oh, even the flying sheep gets out of the way. Do we see anything special? There we see, oh, a beast bear, a bestiary and a spirit lodge. One of each. Actually, I think that's what he did last game as well. Uh, but the first game he went double bestiary. So we'll see less wyvern this game. But I, I think we're going to see Wyvern it. No Raiders. Because that's what he did last game. Double Arcane Sanctum going up. Mount King going up. Going up, guys. Going up. I mean, they haven't crept anything in the last 10 minutes. Can you explain why the Blade Master likes to chase old man on horse? He, it's just because there's... Uh, he doesn't want to be killed by the old man on the horse. The old man on the horse will summon... If he, if he can kill other units, like, this is the thing, like, the old man on the horse with the footman, they want to kill these innocent blade units on the map. But the blade master doesn't want the old man on the horse and the footman to kill, oh, there goes the footman, to kill those units. So he's just saving those units. He's just protecting them. That's what the blade master does. He's a protector, guys. He's like a superhero. He's like Batman. Shadow Hunter. Keeping over here. The piggy. Still alive. This, uh... Couple goes out. Nice one, Chaco. Is this role <laughs> playing commentary? What? Archmage is going for the Sasquatch here. There's a Mountain King. And there's some Priest, a Priest, a Sorceress, and Arcane Vault going up. Do we have Wyvern? Oh no, never mind. You know, like I was saying, he's going Raiders this game. You guys heard me say that, right? That's exactly what I was saying. No Wyvern this game. Anti word placed there by the Mountain King. Archmage sells some items. He's level 2. Mountain King level 1. Okay. Jojo Hatchrinker going for this item. This uh, Renegade Wizard will give a great item. There's no bad item here. Like the worst one is maybe Flute of Accuracy. Or um, the Devotion Aura. Okay, he does get Devotion Aura. Which is, uh, yeah, the second worst one, I think. Even the Bottle of Giant Strength is better than this one. There's a Tome of Strength as well. Okay. Well, okay, here comes the Mountain King. He's going for a creep check? He sees the Sentry Ward. He attacks it, but he lets it live. He sees the Sentry Ward with his own Sentry Ward, by the way. Here comes the creep check, guys. Here it comes. Oh, no. Okay, here it doesn't come. Wait, what? Did he not see him there? <laughs> oh, now he sees him. Or he was waiting for the militia. Beautiful timing here by Blade. Waiting for the militia. This raider, though, is he got the militia should just kill the raider, but they don't. I'm not sure what the militia are doing, but the raider dies in the end. The other units get out of this position. And the blade master, is he in trouble? No, right? No, no. Is he? I mean, it's a little bit of trouble. We have one level one healing wave. Blade Master gets away. There's another raider. There's some peons again. Blade Master go for this footman. Uh, Stormbolt on the Blade Master, and the footman does die. And uh, okay, the, pitch, the Sasquatch angry. The troll's angry, taking revenge against this raider. The Blade Master in trouble. Do we have a Stormbolt? No mana for Stormbolt. Blade Master used the Windwalk. He gets away safely, but uh, I mean, he doesn't use his peace scroll. Doesn't want to use the speed scroll because the blade master was in windwalk and he didn't want to cancel the windwalk because then he can get stormbolted. Uh, so he loses two grunts for not speed scrolling there. Maybe he's just taking the risk, just going for the speed scroll. Hope you uh, get far enough away from the mountain king are under and close enough to your shop and don't lose those two grunts because losing those two grunts were pretty bad there for orc worker. The mountain king just you know killing more shit. I tried to become a raider. Jumped on my dog's back. <laughs> Poor Chihuahua looks in pain. <laughs> guys, be careful with your Chihuahuas. You know, raiders don't ride Chihuahuas, guys. I mean, actually they look a little bit like Chihuahuas. But they're really big Chihuahuas. Okay, nice 66 critical strike by this Blade Master. 
Remember back in the days we would say, oh nice 200, 700, oh wait, what? It doesn't make sense. Nice <laughs> 276 critical strike. Now it's just 66. Yeah, that's a nice critical strike nowadays, guys. 1.29. Kepa. Set <laughs> under level 3. Blade Master level 2. Always go for this rock column. But the rock column her boulders him in the face. The Blade Master right in the face. We see over here Militia finishing off this troll. Is he going for an expansion? Archmage level 3. Almost. Uh, Mount King almost level 3. I mean, the Blade Master level 2. Muddy is angry. No expansion. He's just going back home, guys. They're just going back home. Don't worry. So, this Mount King needs level 3. This Blade Master needs level 3. Supplies are kind of even. Kind of. Let's look at the items. So Archmage has like one mental of intelligence. The Mount King. Rune Bracers completely useless. A Ring of Protection and one Wand Mana Ceiling. So not that great items. Here we have a Shadow Hunter with Lionhorn of Stormwind. He just bought a Potion of Mana. We have a Blade Master with some more Sentry Wars. Not that great at this point in the game. Wand of Mana Ceiling to counteract the Wand of Mana Ceiling of the Mountain King I guess. And uh, it's some more IQ. Gloss of Haste. He should probably give these uh, mana items to the Shadow Hunter. Items not amazing for either player. We have this beautiful fight here. <laughs> yeah, when actually Blade Master Chris exactly the same. I know, guys. I was just trolling. Blade Master level 2, of course. Without any items. No change. <laughs> the footman scouting here. Oh, but the uh, Sentry Ward sees the footman. Footman retreating. Why can't we see the hero levels at the bottom left? Uh, that's because of the 1.29.2 patch made by Blizzard. They changed something. And now my uh, my overlay program that gets the hero levels doesn't work anymore. So, yeah. Hopefully at some point in the future I can get that to work again. Blade Master going for this creep camp. Is Blade going for the other one or is he not going for the other one? Let's see this granite golem. Is he here in time? Blade is 66 supply, orc worker 59. Nice slam there by the rock uh, granite golem. A nice a smiley face by orc worker. That's exactly what I wanted to see here. And the blade master going for the spellbreaker. This uh, raider going down fast though. And he's dead already. Spellbreaker also, you know, dying pretty fast. I assume the Blade Master is level 2 critical strike, but I'm not sure for sure. He kills the one Spellbreaker. This Raider is doing fine. There's another healing wave. The Code is hungry. He eats a, he eats a Spellbreaker uh, militia guy is killing this Raider. Uh, the Raider is going to die slowly. The Mount King, uh, have you seen a clap yet, by the way? I'm not sure if he saw a clap. He's kind of low on mana. Maybe uh, he must have clapped then. Uh, this Raider takes a bit of damage. The so Archmage is killing the Raider. The Raider is gone, guys. But who's gonna win this game? That's what we're trying to figure out here. This spell break. Oh, nice 124 critical strike. That is for sure now. Level 2 crit. And there you see only 40 damage. It's level 1 win block. The crit is going to die. It's 57 against 53 supply. There's Stormbolt on the spell. Walker. Spirit Walker is what I meant. And do we see more, guys? Actually, yeah, I'm not sure if, he's, if he has clapped. There's another Stormbolt on this Kodo. I haven't seen claps, guys. This Kodo is going down. This Kodo with the healing wave there survives. And Spellbreak is uh, Berserker. Is he, is he alive? Yeah, there was a bash. There was a bash, guys. You guys saw that bash? Nice bash and Stormbolt on the Shadowhunter. I think. Or unless there was more more bashes, maybe. This Water Mental goes down. Blade Master go for this, uh, this guy. Okay. Beautiful. He's going for the Sorceress now. It's really taking a lot of damage. He goes down. There's not a bash on the ground. There's Stormbolt on the first row. Set a uh, Berserker. He's dead. The Kodo takes the healing wave because Shadow Hunter is uh, in the back here just healing everyone. That's what he likes to do. He's a healer, guys. He uh, he joins your World of Warcraft party and he, he picks a priest. He does retreat, though. He retreats. Blade Master killing the Spellbreaker just slowly. It seems like uh, Orc Worker is only 9 supply behind. So if you can just pick off these low hit point units somehow. Nice, uh, nice Stormbolt on this Raider. Passing pretty low as well. Nice bash again on the red. The red is dead. Now we have level 4 Mount King. Level 2 bash is, of course, so insane. Let's see this bash. Is 123 critical strike. Ooh, um, uh, Mount King has an info potion. 
Mind the King. Get oh no, Mind the King. Use the info potion. Nice info potion. Was it a bash or a storm bolt there on the blade master? I think it was a bash, right? Nice timed bash there. I, I you know actually there was not a super nice timed bash, but it was a it was a bash. That's for sure. There's a nice uh, another bash there. Blade master was about to crit, but he cancelled his attack there, so he didn't crit. Spellbreaker, Steel Link, Spirit Link. Well, I mean, the Spellbreaker takes a bit of damage here. Blade Master, 108 critical strike, 141 critical strike. That's nice. Spellbreaker, does he die? Um, no. No. This Water Elemental, 120 critical strike now. Some more crits, and the Orc Worker would just take this game. The Shadow Hunter heals himself. Of course, there's a shop here, so uh, not a good position for Blade to fight at all near the Orc Shop. Shadow Hunter just keeps buying items. Keeps prolonging the life of everyone. Look, everyone at full health. Why? Shop, guys. Orc worker, voodoo launch. Shop. Okay, there's some creeps here. There's some creeps. Murlocs are dead. We have a flying sheep over here. I was just thinking, guys. If I ever make a web shop, if I ever make like a, uh, a merchandise shop for my stream, maybe I could call it like Hi to Chaco's Food Launch or Hi to Hi to Food Launch. Blade Master. What item did he get? Crystal Ball. Again, just like last game, this is exactly what Orc Worker deserves, guys. Crystal Ball. This game, at least. Spion is in trouble. Spion is he dead? He's dead! So these grunts, I mean, the grunts are zero, zero. Spell, the Spellbreaker is taking a bit of damage. There's two grunts here, two peons. Uh, one grunt goes down the coat. Is he hungry at all? I mean, this spellbreaker is not that tasty. It's like a rotten sandwich at this point. This uh, this raider takes a heal wave. I mean, he, you know, he survives. He's dead now, actually. 130 critical strike. The spellbreaker goes down. Uh, again, he's fighting near the orc shop. I'm not sure if this is smart here for Blade. Like, orc worker is up in supply and he's up in, uh, you know, positioning. This, R this shadow hunter is almost level 5. This blade master is almost level 5. This is like the worst position for Blade to fight. I'm not sure why he took this fight. There goes a grunt and a raider. Okay. But if this water metal f dies. Okay. He denied it, right? Yeah, he denied it. If he got the XP there, both these heroes would be level 5. There are Murlocs over there. So maybe he's, that's that's why he's fighting. He wants to fight because he doesn't want these level... Uh, these Shadowhunter and the Blade Master to hit level 5. But even just devouring this Spellbreaker will give, give level 5. Speed call back to his shop. Very smart by Orc Worker, he knows. As long as I fight near the shop, I win the game. He only has one Raider though, so it's not like he can force uh, a fight really at one position. Uh, Blade will just keep uh, Mike going back. Keep kiting. There goes Grunt. Spellbreaker though. There it goes. Level 5 Shadow Hunter, level 5 Blade Master. And that is just so strong. You might have a level 5 Arc Mage, but without a level 5 Mountain King, and without Clap, especially, I mean, or either, either one. He's not gonna win this fight. Blade is not gonna win this fight, guys. He's just gonna lose slowly and swiftly. Wait, Chaco, those have opposite meanings. <laughs> he's just gonna he's just gonna lose. Just let's keep it to that. He's just going to lose, guys. Uh Stormbolt on the Blade Master, but he wind walked, but he still took the damage. But he didn't take any follow-up damage. There's another healing wave on the Blade Master. He's not going to die. Hello. Uh the Shadow Hunter is kinda out of mana again. He has one more healing wave. And he will have to use it here to save the Blade Master, Orc Worker! Okay, there it is. <laughs> the Bash is just kill killing this Blade Master. Uh, is the Blade Master gonna die? Is he actually going to die here? Um, yeah. Well, okay. Well, that GG. Blade wins 3 to 0, guys. He goes to the High to Chaco League this. Uh, finals this uh, this Saturday. It's gonna be exciting. We have eight players now.